We've asked students, faculty, and community members to tell us what the collection means to them. My name is Theos Munvaneza. I'm 22 years old and a psychology student at the U of S. The University of Saskatchewan could support queer students on campus by um, focusing on mental health services a bit more. Many queer students are more likely to face um, financial struggles and poverty and really struggle a lot with being able to juggle maybe like a job as well as school and find that the tuition is very difficult to cover on their own as a lot of the people that I know who are in similar situations as me have to um, come up with their own funds for a higher education and places like this, the archives, which are such beautiful troves of knowledge are not as accessible as they should be um, for people like me who might feel kind of alone otherwise. And knowing that we have such resources and history that that many people should have the opportunity to see but aren't because of mental health or struggling with poverty, um, it's, it's a real shame. It's very encouraging as a queer person to know the amount of history that even a place that's a bit less diverse, like Saskatoon, um, that has um, so much pride in, um, in their history and in their gay history and in um, knowing that there's been gatherings of queer people Knowing that I can find stories from people who felt the way I did that I will never meet and that um, lived a very different life than I did and knowing that they, I could potentially find um, remnants from someone's life who I can really understand and connect with in a way that, that I might not do in the, way, in the world around me currently. Is, I think it's very powerful knowing that people have felt the way that I have for a long, long time.